One thing has touched me very deeply. What happens to the family? What happens outside the walls? A lot of these prisoners will go home and find there's not a family there, that the family has broken, and this is very painful. Some of the places where the Prison Fellowship volunteers visit are quite primitive. When we bring in gifts, food items, whatever we can bring, they are quite appreciated. These are the families of inmates who are presently in prison. John and his family are a classic example of a prisoner's family. While John was inside, we were helping his family. And uh, even when he's out, we continue. And we'd like to continue doing that until they are stable and well supported. That is one thing I'm very, very grateful of, especially to the donors, those who have been donating and assisting the prison fellowship in Fiji to keep my children in school and my family. I came to see that there is a Lord, there is a God. When Bill came out of jail, a small grant from the government got him started in his own business. But he had a far greater challenge. How would he put things right with his wife? God became real to me because on the day when uh, I came out from prison, there was no place to go. There was no place to go at all. So I, was, I went to one, one of uh, the prison fellowship volunteers' house and spent the day and the night. On the day he came out of prison, he found out that his wife had gone to live with another man. His own relations didn't want him back. The relations of the wife didn't want him back. So he was left high and dry. But with the knowledge of the Lord that he had acquired, it enabled him to go through that. My family didn't even want this one to come back, want Bill to come back to our place because of what he did and because he went to prison. Through the prison fellowship, Uncle Jack and Eddie Volau came together with this one, and uh, we had a talk at home, and we reconciled. I'm really happy because Bill is a changed man now, before he went to prison. When I came out from prison, I have nothing at all, but I'm so thankful that God restored my wife back to me and my house, and my God is so good to me. Help me. 